to my channel, say Fonsi here in the building. So without wasting time, news reaching us from Obodo Ibo TV is that Chinedu's wife denied collecting money from her. Chinedu's wife was the one who cried out that her husband abandoned her and the kids and took their papers away. On investigation, we found out that Chinedu has been living in Nigeria. He has a shop. On another news, we heard that Chinedu gave the paper to somebody to be using. Why he, he was not deported? So, but that's not the main gist. The main gist is that when Obodo Ibo TV heard about this, she contacted Don Osage, who had the case, and collected the number of this Chinedu's wife. And then, the woman's name is Joy. Chinedu's wife is Joy. She has two children. She came on live, and we all watched how she was answering all the questions thrown at her. And lots of subscribers, fans of Obodo Ibo TV, contributed money. Obodo Ibo TV pleaded with them to contribute money to support this woman. They contributed money. We all contributed money. And at the end of it, of everything, she gave the money. The money was 600000 but she decided to give the woman 500000 first. So that after, she will give her the remaining 100000 And she took the money. She was, the money was paid into the account of her cousin. The, num, the account she provided because she didn't have account. When they asked her, she said, no, the person where seafood job, they get account. So she bought the account of somebody. And Obodebo TV paid in the sum of whooping 500k inside this account. Then, Obodebo TV was surprised. When she saw the interview of, people sent it to her, of course. The interview, which I also watched, of um, John Osage asking Joy, who had already back herself with beautiful clothes her kids looking cute because she already has money in her hand she asked her have you gotten the money the hundred thousand contributed by obodebo tv she said no wow she, he asked her again she said no and obodebo tv saw it and she was shocked because this could damage her reputation her image saying she has not received any money so but what I'm thinking was that because Obodebo TV was forced to call Joy and recorded her. She didn't record her when she sent the money. She recorded her asking her, why did you deny collecting 500k? Then the Joy was saying that she didn't know it was her, that she didn't know. But on, on another angle, I felt that Don Osage said Obodo TV. Then her, 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 her name is Obodo Yimbo, Obodo Oyimbo TV. But Don Osage was asking her, has Obodo Yibo, Obodo, no, not Obodo, Oyibo. Obodo Yibo means abroad, Europe. Obodo, Obodo means ta, um, state or town. Oyibo means Oyibo people. So, Don Osage asked her, has Obodo TV giving you the money? He didn't ask her Obodo Yibo TV. So I feel that maybe that was why, because this woman, she has been through a lot and her mind is just going za 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 za. So, Obodo Yibo TV, don't be angry with her or disappointed with her. I feel that she thought John Osage was saying Obodo TV, another channel, maybe another channel that contributed money for her, which is 600k, but Obodo Ibo TV gave her 500k. So maybe she was thinking that Obodo, Obodo Ibo TV gave her 500k, but there is another Obodo TV that has contributed 600k for her, and maybe that is why she said no, and maybe she didn't, you know, so I don't know how to explain this, I don't think that woman is trying to deny because why would she deny it when she knows that she was recorded and put on on the youtube facebook that they have collected money for her and she's even looking neat where did she get money to back herself so i said that jonasage did not raise any money for her jonasage was trying to raise money for the husband as his fellow man but it's always up to women to assist women so obrebo tv took pity off on her and did it and it was 600k but obrebo tv decided to send 500 first even people were telling her to give her small, small, so that she will not waste the money. So I see that the mistake came from John Osage calling her Obodo TV and saying that it's 600k. But Joy had already gotten only 500k and it's from Obodo Imbo TV, not from Obodo TV. So do you guys get my logic, my analytic? So that is why I felt the, where the misunderstanding came from. So I won't blame Obodo Imbo TV. She did her work perfect. She helped out. She She's a philanthropist. Philanthropist. <laughs> Then, I don't blame Joy. Joy, with her condition and mental here and there, she mistook Obodo TV 600k, Obodo Yimbo TV 500k, you see? Then, I don't blame John Osage too much because 
He just called her Obodo TV. Maybe that is how he pronounces it. But if you look well, you see that Obodo TV is different from Obodo Ibo TV. And I'm sure that if you go and search, there might be some people answering Obodo TV. So that is where the major problem came from. That is the where the misunderstanding came from. And this is the kind of forces that could make this woman lose more help that she's about to get from people. Because people will be like, this woman that when you give her something, she will deny, she will lie. I know that there are still more people that want to reach out to her directly, talk to her and help her out with money and houses, everything. Even some people that want to help her to relocate back to, to Europe. But this kind of thing is the forces that makes people to turn, turn away from helping the person. And this is the kind of thing that would have brought problems to Obodo Ibo TV to discourage people from trusting her. But she has cleared her name right now. And from hearing from hearing from her, speaking with Joy, I I went in and I understood that the misunderstanding came from having Obodo TV and Obodo Imbo TV and having 600k, 500k. You see where the problem is from. So please, Obodo Imbo TV, don't get angry with her or um, let it not discourage you from helping people in Africa. Even self, those ones in Africa, they are the ones that need help. If you see what women are going through, you will help, you will shed tears. They need help more than those in Europe. Those ones in Europe, government are supporting them. But you see those ones in Africa. <laughs> those ones in Niger, they are going through hell. They are going through a lot. There are so many of them that their husbands are abroad. They are, we are not opportune to step foot into Europe. And they are there. They don't know who to reach out to. They don't even have data to watch YouTube. They don't even know that there are platforms that exist that help people out. Can you see Joy's case? It took her 30 years to be able to hear from somebody that there is somebody that can help her, bring her out so that people will support her. Before you got to know her and you helped her out. This is how God touches lives of people. But sometimes, little misunderstanding can just scatter your way and make people distrust you and close doors. This kind of misunderstanding would have closed doors of more people that need help from Obodo Ibo TV. It would have closed doors from Joy receiving more help. And it would have brought misunderstanding between John Osage and Obodo Ibo TV and Joy. But thank God that everything is coming into places. And that is it. Little misunderstanding. It's always good to clear yourself out, to clear your name. So Obodo TV did well by throwing it up and clearing her name so that before people will start, because some people little thing, they will start misjudging somebody. And John Osage did well by doing that recording to clarify everything and to let the whole world know that she has gotten the help that she seeks for. You guys all tried in all these things to make this woman smile again. So thank you for watching. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed. Like, comment, share and tell me your own thoughts. Do you believe that this woman really want to hide the fact that she has been giving money? Or do you think that it's not her fault? That is the fault of um, Obodo Ibo TV? No. But what do you think? I mean let's focus on Joy, Chinedu's wife. Do you think that she is trying to deny collecting the money? Or do you think that she misunderstood John Osage, thinking that there is another Obodo TV? Or do you think that she did not hear very well what she was asked? Because they asked her before she knelt down and was dancing. They repeated the question. The question changed that she has not collected any money. So you guys should remember that this woman has gone through a lot. Her mental needs, she needs a mental help. So let's not blame her. If you still have any assistance for her, please assist her. Whether she knows or not, or whether she remembers or not, you have done it and it's up to God in heaven to reward you. Okay? So, with that, I'm saying thank you. Subscribe, subscribe, like, comment, share, and see you in my next video. Bye bye.